England's Anthony Wall has been an ever-present in the top 100 of the Race to Dubai rankings for 15 straight seasons. Whilst his maiden victory on the European Tour came at the Alfred Dunhill Championship in 2000, his best year to date was in 2006, when he secured three second places to finish 13th in the Race to Dubai. However, by 2013, Anthony was struggling with injury and beginning to slip off the golfing radar. Well, I had surgery right at the start of the year. I had uh, a stress fracture in my right ankle and also quite bad cartilage damage in my left hip, so I've been carrying that for a couple of years. I had a number of injections and it got to the point really. I played in Qatar and did well actually, but pain just got to the point where it was too much. So I, had, I went uh, in surgery on Wednesday after Dubai last year, 2013. Once committed to the surgery, Anthony knew there would be a lengthy recovery period. Taking the step away from competitive golf for such a period of time could have been detrimental to Anthony's game. It's not just the physical element of being a professional golfer, readjusting to life on tour could also prove a challenge. I had seven months off. Uh, I only played, I think I played four rounds of golf before I came back. I think I, I pretty much, I made a cut on my first first one back at Cron last year, which was a real achievement, one of my best achievements, I think, in golf. But yeah, it's not easy, but you've just got to get back into uh, real life on tour. It's difficult, it's difficult, you're hitting loads of balls, loads of shots, and that's that's the hard bit. It's travelling, is hard, it's tiring on the, it's, the stress on the, on the, on the body, is difficult, so you've got to deal with that as well as the golf. So yes, it is hard, but I've done it for a long time now, I feel I know what I'm doing. Anthony can now practice before European Tour events with minimal pain and discomfort. He is still on the path to full recovery though and has taken his practice regime back to basics. I just work on the same, literally four or five things and we just constantly maintain those and in each discipline of the game, wedge play, short game stuff, we just try and always chip away at it, pardon the pun, but basically just there's four things I work on and I always make sure I still do those. Now back on track physically and back in the swing of things on tour, Anthony can start to look ahead to the future. He hopes his better health and new streamlined training regime can lead to improved results on the golf course and perhaps even a return to his best form. My goal is to get back to where I was in 2005, 6, 7 when I was a really high ranked player. That's where I want to go and I felt with the problems I had, I, could, I couldn't achieve that. You know, I wasn't, I hadn't really practiced for two years. I used to just come to tournaments and play golf. You know, I wasn't having many lessons. I couldn't stand there for three, four hours hitting balls. It was pointless. If I did, then I was, I'd be in pieces for a month. So, if I want to get back to where I was, I need to, I needed to do it. And with some solid results this year, Anthony is clearly on the way back.